Hello chess fans. Welcome to my chess ball. Today we are covering the exciting day one of the Chess Olympiad 2024 for Team India. There were some thrilling games, surprising upsets and standout performances that you won't want to miss. Day one of the Chess Olympiad set the stage for an incredible tournament. More than 190 teams from around the world are contesting for the title of strongest chess nation in Budapest, Hungary. The intensity was palpable right from the start. India is ranked second in open section and top seeded in women's section. Let's take a quick look at how the day unfolded for team India. In open section, India won all the four games. Pragnananda playing white faced Sicilian defense. Pragnananda went for the open Sicilian. Opponent chose the classical variation. Pragnananda kept on making good moves, gradually consolidated his position and kept on putting more pressure on the opponent. At move 28, Pragnananda already has significant advantage. At this position, opponent made a mistake, rook e8. Pragnananda punished it with bishop takes f5 and soon the game collapsed. Now, after queen d2 or queen e3, the h6 pawn will fall and black's position will collapse. So the opponent resigned here. On the second board, Arjun Erigasi, playing with black pieces, went for the Nimzo Indian defense. At move 12, Arjun made a mistake, bishop takes b4. After a takes b4, knight takes b4 and queen b1, Arjun had a very difficult position, but after c5, opponent made a blunder, rook takes a6, and Arjun came back with knight takes a6. In the end game, the opponent made a mistake, king f3, and Arjun punished it precisely. The opponent resigned in these positions as the two passers of black are too much for black to handle. Vidit Gujarati playing on the third board opened with Roy Lopez. At the eighth move, the opponent played bishop d7, trying to avoid bishop exchange with the knight. But it's a mistake. He should have went for a move like bishop e7 followed by castle. Vidit kept on finding good moves and put lot of pressure on the opponent. So, at the move 28, finally the opponent resigned in this position. As Vidit's rooks will soon land on the 7th rank, putting lot of pressure and his pawns on the king side are dangerous. On board number 4, Hari Krishna with black pieces went for the Sicilian defense. Opponent went for the Rosolimo variation. In this position at move number 27, Hari Krishna has small advantage, but opponent made a mistake, f5. Hari Krishna punished it with b4. Hari Krishna soon went on to win the game. In women's section, India won three games and drew one game. Vaishali with black pieces went for Queen's Gambit declined. At move number 22, the opponent made a mistake, knight e5. Vaishali correctly punished it with knight b3. After rook c to d1, Vaishali won important d4 pawn. The opponent finally resigned at move number 29 in this position, as the checkmate is unavoidable. At board number 2, Divya Deshmukh had to fight very hard to bring home the victory against Rachel Miller of Jamaica. Divya started with the English opening. After finding lot of good moves and offering a good resistance, finally her opponent made a mistake at move number 49, rook e4. This allowed Divya to play knight e2 and win important d4 pawn. Finally, the opponent resigned in this position as move number 76, as Divya's connected pass pawns would soon bring home her victory. 
एट बोर्ड नंबर थ्री इंडिया हैड टू बी कंटेंट विथ अ ड्रॉ एज वंदिका अगरवाल अपोनंट रेहाना ब्राउन पुट अप अ रियली गुड शो वंतिका अपोनंट प्लेइंग वाइट स्टार्टेड विथ द इंग्लिश ओपनिंग बोथ द प्लेयर्स केप्ट ऑन फाइंडिंग गुड मूव्स एंड डिड नॉट अलाउ काउंटर प्ले टू ईच अदर सो फाइनली ड्रॉ वॉज एग्रीड इन दिस पोजिशन एट मू नंबर फिफ्टी थ्री एट बोर्ड नंबर फोर तानिया सचदेव मैनेज टू ब्रिंग होम द विक्ट्री विथ वाइट पीसेस शी स्टार्टेड विथ द क्वीन पॉन ओपनिंग द ओपोनंट वेंट फॉर द स्लाव डिफेंस एट मू नंबर एटीन हर ओपोनंट मेड अ मिस्टेक रुक एफ टू डी एट This allowed Tania to start a pawn storm on the king side. Tania managed to consolidate her advantage and bring home victory at number forty-one in this position. The opponent resigned as checkmate is unavoidable. The biggest upset of first round was 17-year Anas Khaira from Jordan holding Super GM Shakriyar Mamidiarov to a draw from a better position. Mamidiarov was forced to sacrifice the exchange, after which Mamidiarov offered a draw. Anas declined it, but accepted the draw much later when he was in time trouble. Fantastic result for a young player, and certainly one he will cherish for a long time to come. Few other major upsets were Nadir Bek Yakubov of Uzbekistan drew Queen Cabralis of Trinidad and Tobago. Please note that Uzbekistan is the defending champion and gold medalist of Chess Olympiad 2022. Aryan Tari of Norway drew Hogjin Ann of South Korea. Also, US Super GM Levon Aronian was pieced down against Andre Mendez of Panama. but he managed to complicate and win the game standings after first round are india mains team is joint topper with two match points and perfect four game points india women's team is joint second with two match points and 3.5 game points teams are already positioning themselves for the next round who will rise to the occasion and who will falter we will be here to cover all the action That wraps up our India Day 1 highlights from the Chess Olympiad 2024. Make sure to like, subscribe and hit the bell icon so you don't miss any of our future updates. Leave a comment below with your thoughts on today's games and who you are rooting for. See you next time.